Good evening, my little moonbeams. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, and the not- er, the not so berry? No, honey, no. Are we gonna cook? Is that a thing we're gonna do? Um, and the Black Widow challenge. Um, we- I can't remember what episode we're on. Um, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm gonna be real. It is 5.21pm as of right now. It's almost 5.30. I am exhausted. I had three hours of sleep. Two energy drinks before 11 o'clock this morning. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's a ringing in my ear right now. I, like, everything went muted in the other ear. But, um, and then of course I had my niece. Oh, Maya. I remember you're feeding that to your children. <laughs> like, not just Jang. Oh, Jang's upset. Okay. Oh, he's good. He's, he's using the bathroom. Okay. Um, but, uh, she was originally gonna be picked up at noon, but we went to my aunt's house and did 4th of July stuff there. Because we are, um, it's 4th of July as of recording this. And... It's Independence Day for America. National holiday. Um, we didn't watch fireworks, but I've been watching fireworks for the last, I don't know, week? Week and a half now? Because my neighbors apparently didn't get the memo that today is the 4th of July. <laughs> like, come on guys, come on. <laughs> no, grab a serving of that. And you're gonna use the bathroom. Okie doke. Um... Today, I plan on getting them engaged. Now, I have already recorded this once before. <laughs> None of you would know that, though. No, 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 no. I've recorded this. They got engaged, It was, and then they got married, and it was beautiful. We were going to have a, uh, a dinner party because I was just going to get it over with, and then I was going to kill him somehow. I didn't know how. I was just gonna do it. And then my game completely froze up and stopped working. Like, completely stopped working for whatever odd reason. And it probably has something to do with custom content that I have been using. Um, just, I have so much of it. I have over 5,000 pieces of CC. So, I mean, like, what are you gonna do? Um, so. We're gonna grab a serving. Actually, we're gonna pick up servings. We're gonna pack one into a sack lunch for Gomez to take to school. Um, because I mean, there we go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I'll sleep going. Um, but. He has work in three days, and of course she doesn't have a job. So we're going to wait until Gomez goes to school. What are you doing? No, 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 that's so not what I meant for you to do. Where are you going, man? Uh, she's gonna clean up. She's gonna be all domesticated. Because I just don't feel like dealing with it today. Oh, he's gonna go to school. Um. What's wrong- what are you doing? Oh, you have more dishes over here. Okay. <laughs> like, what? Ah, <laughs> oh, goodness. Um, let's see. Let's clean this up. Yeah, if I seem a little less excited or enthused, that's why. Like, the first time I watched, or I recorded this, I was so, like, bam, in your face, and... No, I'm like so exhausted, but today is the only, you know, we're just going to travel. I did the date last time and, you know, I got gold, but okay, for a second I was like, what's going on? That music sounded so creepy, but we're good. We're good. Uh, we're going to Newcrest. You know, I just ate- I just ate hot dogs and I'm hungry again. 
Oh, it was a feast. I love when my aunt and uncle do the 4th of July party. Like, my uncle's an amazing cook. I actually don't think I have any family, like, any uncles who aren't amazing cooks. Holy moly. Like, Facebook. Kablam. Kablam. If you guys haven't visited the Facebook page, you really should. <laughs> so I posted on my personal Facebook. Was feeling scared. Um, my niece ripped a green pine cone in half. And I was like, that's a baby tree. Or, that's a tree's baby. And she says, well, the tree's baby is dead. And I was like, <laughs> and uh, her mom, like, just saw that status, and she was like, <laughs> she's oh my gosh, with the laugh cry face, like, my niece says some, some weird stuff. Uh, she's the same niece that'll play Minecraft, and, uh, we had this table when we came up last time, so for, like, in my tired, overly tired, like, I'm so tired, guys, I'm going to be going to sleep after this. Um, after, of course, I get some proper hydration in me, I'm probably gonna be so sunburned tomorrow. Like, I can feel my face is really warm. If you hear th that's me getting a drink of water. Because I probably did not drink enough water today. It's really important when it's hot like this to be properly hydrated. Also, what are you guys thinking of the uh, the new Moonlight Makeover series? Where's your hair, honey? Wow, that was dramatic. Are you are you done? You just wanted to be in the video. <laughs> What even? If we get the same table, I'm- We got the same table! What? Okay, I'm gonna turn off Autonomy. Because... That was really annoying last time. Um... That I tried this. I turned it off then, too, but, like, they decided they were gonna, like... Get up. I'm saving because... Last time, what happened was, um... The date ended, they were married. At the end. Um... I'm just going to get them married in here. <clears throat> Not because I don't want to do a proper wedding, um, but because I just want to speed things along. Uh, but they were they walked out. They both walked out, had a casual stroll along, and then it went into load screen and never stopped loading, which happens sometimes. So I'm going to save before... If I remember, I'm going to save before I... Um, in the episode which she had to pee last time so let me check that yeah i'm gonna have her go pee real quick and i'm gonna have him order for table um because he knows what she wants because i know what they want i know what i ordered last time <laughs> last time i was like oh they have no wine and they actually do i'm kind of curious oh nope okay so th the last time that i was here the one that was, uh, the chef's special, the chef's choice, was the granny smash. I don't know about the other stuff, but, um, I got them dessert because they had just eaten breakfast. Um, so I got them each a cannoli. There we go. <laughs> like, I don't know why it was being a pain in the butt. Crayon raspberry or raspberry crayonulae. Yeah, yep. We'll go with that. Stick into it. Wow, my game is just as tired as I am. <laughs> uh, come on. And then I'll have her come back and sit down. Like, she had to pee really bad last time, so I just wanted to make sure. Um that she oh my goodness are you serious lady like 
What the heck, woman? Sophia? Like, <laughs> come on now. Has he ordered? Are they just waiting? Okay. Yeah, they were, like, they were supposed to be, like, talking about the food and stuff. And I was like, really? Why are you... Be gross, let's not. Oh, no, I'm... I'm on the wrong one. <laughs> like, so, he's gonna be enticing, and he's gonna blow her kiss if I can remember to do that. <laughs> you know, when you're just so tired, you're just like, I can't function. But I wanted to get this episode out to you guys, because I know I'm gonna be way too tired to do it later. Um, he's gonna express his fondness for her. Uh, you know. Telling her how much he loves her and how even though his last marriage didn't work out, he's obviously it's because he's so in love with her. He's gonna profess his undying love. Let's get this done. Oh and of course she likes hearing this because well a girl doesn't or a guy for that matter. And then he's going to uh, propose to her. Here's your meal, enjoy. She's like, okay. Can we? Can we? Okay, I guess we're not proposing. Listen to joke. Make funny face. Can we eat? So, they're. I guess they're gonna eat first. Back in this clutch. What? Wouldn't it be funny if I accidentally made him eat hers? That's fun. That would be funny. Remember when you used to like be able to like feed each other or whatever? Do you remember that? In like Sims 2 I think. And then we'll have him propose. Marriage. Like, you know, cause they're pretty much married anyways. You know. Okay, tea posing. <laughs> middle of my engagement. Oh, And of course she's gonna say yes. And then I'm just gonna have them get married. As soon as this interaction's over. Um, and I'm not even worried about the wine. Do, 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 do. We're just gonna elope immediately. Cause I wanted to throw that dinner party. As I'm ready to move on guys, I'm ready to find someone else. I just wanna get things going. Ah, uh, I, I wanna move into a new house. Like, it might be a little cramped or whatever, depends on what we move into, but um, I'm ready to move into something different. She has too many memories in this house with Jane. Do you hear how unsure she is? Who are you? Von Kumar. And right- Oh, not you. Not you. No, not you. I don't want you to give up for learning. Traces, romantic. Oh, you know him? Friendly. He's gonna drink his wine. I don't know if I have a jealousy enabled or not, but I need to know if he's single. I only ask him if he's single. I don't know if I know that or not. Oh, his spouse is Patrice. Oh, I don't want another married man, but I mean, he's a good looking dude. Oh my. I mean, look at him. He's not a bad looking dude. For being an elder sim. 
Okay, we're gonna pay for our meal. Uh, pay for meal? How can we not pay for our meal? What? I thought you, like, could click on the table and pay for meal. Okay. That's weird. Save. Is it because he's not done drinking his drink? No? Okay, we're just gonna go home then. Um, I'm gonna save it again. I know I keep saving, but like, if something happens, I wanna be able to just pick up where I left off. It's still just deduct it from my, uh, whatever, like, cause obviously you guys see I can't like, if you know a fix for that or whatever, let me know, cause Maybe I can get her to pay for the day, for the dinner. No, cause that's just weird. Nope. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. See, casual stroll. <laughs> Loading screen. Really? Where are you? Go home. Switch to control. Where's that? Do 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 do. If this takes forever, guys, then I'm just gonna cut it out. Okay, I'm back. Um, it didn't take as long as I thought it would, but it took long enough that I'm cutting it out. Um, because obviously we don't need that in our life. Where's my child? Okay. Where is, do I have a potty for him? Do I not have a potty for my son? Well, that just, that's wrong. Yeah, our next spouse, we'll find out who we're marrying. Okay. Life will be amazing. Thank you. Like, I wanna know. Um, and then w I'll find out where they're living. Let's see what I need to bring with me. Because. Oh, we, we're going with the yellow because that's what uh, Jang wants. He wants his son raised with uh, light colors. Which Maya can both understand, but it also drives her absolutely crazy. And he's a little bit starting to dictate the rest of the house as well. So we're going to color the furniture to kind of decorate and show that he's starting to start controlling that because I mean he is he's even deciding what color her vanity table can be and her vanity chair and he like he's like you aren't going to have these horrid dark colors around my child um so like her accessory he's gonna leave that alone she had like she had that before, but like the the flowers, the bubbly, like everything, he's just like, no, it's it's got to be nice, bright, light colors or nothing at all. I mean, and he's really cracking down. I mean, they just got married. But he was already, he was already starting in on her, you know? Like, we're going to lighten up this house. Um, and of course, she's going to let her son have his escape, which is the bedroom. But he's, he's done. He's, and obviously he has no idea about this area, so he's not going to say anything about that. But he refuses to live in a house that is dictated 
by darkness. He's getting depressed from it, is what it is. He's getting depressed. So he's like, this needs to change. And you need to change to make me happy, which you shouldn't tell anybody that they need to change. But, you know, we all know Maya. She's, she's going to let him have his moment. But it's not going to last very long. And he, we all know this. We all know Jing's time is coming. What the heck, man. Um, we all know his time is coming. It's almost up. He has outstayed his welcome. We all know it. My cats are going crazy. <laughs> I think it was... Which one was it that I liked? I think it was this one. Dinosaurs? Yeah. Okay. I'm just trying to see which one was it that I liked. Um... And we're just gonna color everything. I mean, it's taking us not that much time, but... Still feels like forever, huh? <laughs> like, hurry up! But yeah, I just figured since we're already in here... You know, might as well. What? Sure. Uh, but I thought I was coloring the sofa, so... <laughs> that threw me for a loop. You ever get thrown for a loop so hard, you're like... I'm a little dizzy right now. <laughs> Check back in with me. Yeah, like, even... Even that. Um, the candles... Like, he's everything. Everything. Everything must change. Because he's not happy. He's like that, though. He's... Like, again, he doesn't want his child growing up. Am I doing the windows? <laughs> Am I coloring the windows? Coloring the windows. Let's... I don't need to color the windows. We're good. The windows don't need coloring. Like, he does not want his child growing up in darkness. And of course, Goma sees what's going on and he's confused by it. Because he's like, Mom, why... You're perfect the way you are. I don't understand why you're changing for him. And I mean, he is wise beyond his years. Gomez is, I mean. But... You know. Sometimes you do fall for somebody and you change who you are for them and that can be a good thing or it can be a bad thing. If you're compromising your personal integrity for someone else, that's a bad thing. Um, but if it, they're changing you for the better, I mean, that's fine. And that's what he sees. Like, he thinks he's changing her for the better, but he's just changing her. But. What he doesn't realize is he's changing her in a way he wasn't really anticipating. He's teaching her how to blend better. How to perfect her craft. He doesn't realize that what he's teaching her is how to better manipulate the situation to her advantage. I mean, would you think that? If you were tr you thought you were trying to help somebody and instead you were actually causing them to better hone their craft. I was going to say how many more of those are there. <laughs> Alright, I think that's it. I mean, we still have to throw a dinner party real quick. Alrighty. So she's going to... Just gonna throw that dinner party. I think we will uh, give him his exit in the next episode. Oh, not travel. New no. dinner party. Um, where is it? Uh, plan a social event. We're also going to save just in case things don't work out on this as well. As in, like. Nobody shows up. It glitches out for some reason. 
Um, we're gonna have him come over here and play Blick Block or yeah, Blick Block because I want him to be able to travel. Dinner party and dinner, dinner, dinner. I mean, should we do a dinner party? I know that it says dinner party for the Black Widow challenge, but maybe we should do like house party or dance party. Because I feel like dinner party would get pretty tedious. I know we're supposed to do dinner party that it like, you know, we get everybody like, like we're supposed to show our husband that we're the perfect uh, wife or whatever, but, um, I don't know. <laughs> what do you guys think? I mean, we'll throw the dinner party this time, but I want to hear what you guys think in the, in the comments. Let me know. Dinner party, or should we start throwing, like, black and white bash and, um, birthday parties and, incognito costume and dance and house and uh, weenie roasts you know different things like that just I mean depending on the the person we're with you know like I think he would be more interested in a house party or a dinner party so we'll go with the dinner party but I'll invite them um, Gomez and Normans, of course. Uh, okay, so Gomez, Norman, and Dominic. And then we should also invite Dominic's wife. Where's Mo Moira? Did I skip her already? Or do we know her, don't we? I'm not gonna invite Mila, only because once we get Mila, we'll never get rid of Mila. Marcus, Candy, Bjorn, um, Nina, like, she cleans up nice. We'll invite Mortimer. I don't know who else we can invite. Should we invite Anya? <gasps> no, we'll invite Akira. Vaughn, Joaquin. We'll just keep going until it tells us we can't anymore. Summer Richards, Jade Rosa. I think I've got like as many as I can do. Yeah. Like, I was like, how many can I do? But there we go. Um, we're gonna hire the role for a caterer, but I don't know that we'll be able to get a caterer. Um. I'm looking at these different places and thinking. I think we'll just do it here. Uh, no. Okay, so we're going to thank our guest for coming. Uh, where is... Oh, we're going to make garden salad as well. Um, make a garden salad. Cook. This one's gonna be a little bit longer, guys, just for the event. Because, like I said, I want... I'm ready to move on from Jing. Let's be honest. Um. Have Sims dance at the same time. Let's get a DJ booth. Let's do it. Activities and skills. And we'll hire a DJ. Why not, right? Like, she's trying to prove, you know, like, yeah, I'm the perfect wife. Love me. Before you die. I got dark. <laughs> this is gonna have a darker LP, though. No, no, no. Where, where's the DJ boots? Am I missing them? Oh. Okay, well, I mean, we can afford this one, and it might not catch on fire, so I mean, yeah. Oh, he wants everything, like, super light, though. Um, we're gonna put this stuff, like, we're just gonna sell it. 
I know I just recolored it and stuff, but we're just gonna sell it. I mean, we don't really need it, right? And then we'll get a dance floor to go with it. A dance floor! Cause we're awesome. We'll go with like the orange or something. Yeah. That does not look right at all for some reason. Actually, that looks really good. Does it look good purple? No, it looks good blue. There we go. And then we'll hire, um, hire staff. DJ Headliner, professional DJ. We'll, we'll do that. Um, have any of the guests started showing up? Like... Nobody's showing up to my party. There we are. Like, come on now. Did you start making food? You didn't even start making the stupid salad. Like, come on lady, more choices to cook. Fruit, er, not fruit salad. Garden salad, party of eight. More choices open, or did you put it away? No, you didn't even put away. You just like seriously, woman. Seriously. Um, seriously though. Come on now. Dance. Nobody's here. Did nobody come to my party? That's so sad. Our dinner party is going to be a bust because nobody wants to come. Like, is this lot like glitched or something? <gasps> Thanks, Billy. We should have invited you to our party. Yes, you should invite over Billy. Uh, dance. <laughs> dance. <laughs> Cause obviously, nothing. Like what the heck, man? Oh, that's so sad. Nobody came to our party. Seriously? Nobody. Where's our meal? Uh, call to meal. I want to at least get like a... I mean, I know we're supposed to get like silver, but I think... <laughs> Can we thank her for coming? Can we thank Billy for coming? Choo choo choo. No, it doesn't look like we <laughs> we can't even thank Billy for coming. Like that sucks. <laughs> okay, we're gonna end this. Um, only because nobody came to our party. Um so that was stupid. We glitched out a little bit, I think. And I don't know what it is. But we got a gently used book in our Sims inventory, so that's something. <sighs> Who is this? She needs to go give him a flirty introduction. And he is gonna come over here and he's gonna come take a shower. Actually, he's gonna give his daughter some love because he hasn't seen his daughter. Anya keeps him from her. Friendly. Um. Okay, I thought I said friendly. Nope, that's, that's the wrong button. <laughs> More choices. More choices. Hug lovingly. Yeah, he's gonna come love his love on his daughter. Um, she's gonna come flirt with the DJ, Trey Eddie. Friendly. Ask him if he's single. Hopefully, no do. 
Apparently he's just gonna hang out here. Seriously, man. Come hug your child because you missed her. Did we find out if he's single? He is single. Trey Eddie. You'd make a nice baby, Dada. Look at that face. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. Oh, you know what? We should check her age. She's got two days to age up. Um, I think in the next episode we'll end up drinking that potion of youth. Oop, my bad. Like she will probably drink it as she's watching him die. Like we're gonna have to find out where Cherry Eddie lives. I think he might be our next target. I don't know. Let's look. Loves. Looks like, uh, besides Dominic, he's the only one who might. I like him. Honest to God, I like him. Look at his face. He is cute. He will make a very cute baby and I'm hoping he'll give me my girl I really really want a girl <laughs> so bad <sighs> oh. um, I'm gonna find out where he lives real quick and then I'll come back and we'll end the episode so one minute guys okay guys I'm back and I just found out that he lives in San Mayshuno but not only does he live in San Mayshuno he lives in the fashion district, and I'm gonna give you a guess as to which of these three places he lives. Ready? Pause the video and take a guess. Okay, are you ready? Is it this one? No, that's Jang Pizzazz and Palma. Is it this one? No, it's Suarez and Karaoke Legends. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. He lives in this apartment. He lives in this penthouse. Like, what? We're moving in here. He's our next target. I was thinking like he was gonna live in the Culpepper apartments or the Jasmine Suites, um, or even like the Medina Studios. Maybe Chic Street. I don't like one of the apartments that you can afford for like 20,000 like a starter apartment um and I remember I'd already chosen him before this just makes him a bigger target because I have a house I'm saving up for and I really 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 want to move I mean obviously living on this island nobody could catch a ferry to our party so <laughs> A disaster. So, yeah. So, I'm gonna go, like, bananas trying to get him in the next episode. And, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm so surprised. And he's gonna make such a great baby. I hope... We have a little girl with red hair. What's going on? You see this? Did you see that clipping? That weirdness? And of course she's wearing like... Um... You know, the hot to trot dress. But this is where I am going to end the episode, guys. I'm going to pre-film the next episode, so I'm going to be filming right after this one. So... Um, but it's still going to be released next week. Um, just because I don't know what's going on next week. And I kind of want to work on this guy. Because I'm just like, what? What? So I will, s like, thank you so very much for watching. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. I am so excited. And I will see you guys in the very next episode. Bye, guys!